I'm Alan Moret, the finest rural investigator the documentary world has ever seen. I'm here in the northwest of England, walking around the dusty streets of the villages in the nation's incest capital. I'm stood in the road. Why I'm here? Well, partly because I was in Blackpool attending a stag night where I woke up here in a puddle of sick with scratches from a very, very sexy lady. But the main reason is due to rumours I've heard circulating around children about um, a strange character who is apparently kidnapping and killing cats. He's known to the locals as the Cat Hunter, and I, Alan Moret, am going to track him down. Because he exists. The amount of cat disappearances in this area is very alarming. Four. There have been strong allegations, made by me, against the council accusing them of hiring the cat hunter to kill the cats, or vermin, as they say. In previous rural investigations I've done, the council have always been the root of all evil. I'm going in here to speak to Councilman Grenall. I have a feeling he's up to no good. I've got an interview with him, but he doesn't want he doesn't want to be heard, so I'm going to have to covertly record him. Um, I have by myself prepared some very well constructed questions, so it should go quite well on my end. I don't know about on the receiving end though, because I'm probably going to be speaking to a man who's a little bit backwards. So here we go. Hi, Mr. Greenall. Actually, it's uh, Mr. Grenhall. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry. No need, no need. What, what's that? Are you recording me? No, no, just, just carrying it. I, I don't mind at all if you are. Yeah, I'm not recording. Yeah, but I can see the tape going round inside. It's always doing that. I can't, I can't stop you it. You could take the batteries out. They are. It just does it by itself. All right, so let's get down to business. I'll just put this down. Due to no fault of my own, the tape stopped recording when I placed it down. However, after realising this, I cunningly managed to start it up again part way through the interview. There's nothing out there. Oh, I thought I saw something. It was it was, it was probably just a brick. Do you have any further questions? Yes. Uh, um, you recognise the fact that an unusual amount of felines have gone missing. Yes. But you put this down to global warming, don't no, you? No, no, I never said that. Really, you're just covering up, aren't you? No. For, for the cat hunter. He, he's working for you, isn't he? No, no, he's not. Admit it, Mr. Greenall. You hire him no. out. He does your dirty work. No. Admit it. You hate cats. No. You can't stand them mincing around You've not around been your paying village. attention to a word I've said, have you? I've, des I've denied his existence several times now and could not offer you an explanation for the disappearance. You can't explain it. You're just hiding the truth. You liar! Right, this interview is over. You're obviously a moron, so let me show you the door. No need to show me. I've seen one before. Thank you. So, are you leaving? Yeah. The interview didn't go as well as I would have hoped. The councilman recognised the fact that an unusual amount of cats had disappeared. He then lied by denying the cat hunter even existed and put the disappearances down to global warming. I'm losing all hope on this project. Found this note, got a bit of a breakthrough. I've deducted just from analysing the way it's written and what's written on it that it's definitely from the cat hunter. So when's high when is high noon? Is it is it one? Twelve. One. Are you sure it's not you mean don't you mean yes, it's one. Twelve. It's twelve o'clock. I tell you, if you've made me wait another hour, you know what? You know what I'll do. This is so it's really now. Anyway. Hello? Who? Oh, oh. Um, okay, yeah, I know what that is, yeah. Do. Can I bring my bike? Yeah. Oh, a nice one, nice one, yeah, uh, okay. Right, I'll see you then, then. Yeah, okay, yeah, no faces, don't worry, we won't show your face. Um, we've got a scarf, we've got, we'll, we just wear a scarf. We'll be, we've got a scarf, we've got a scarf. Alright, bye. Bye. Bye.
I'm off to meet the man himself, the notorious cat hunter, B.I.G. Unfortunately, when I arrived, I couldn't get past the guards. But me being Alan Moret, I effortlessly found another way round. I'm here with the cat hunter and he's gonna have a little chat with me because he's got some questions to answer. Haven't you? Sorry. Cat hunter. Alright. Right, so... We've... I've, well, I've been talking to a lot of children in the area and um, they seem to know you quite well. I mean, why, there are rumours about you, sort of, kill, you kill cats. Yeah. For fun? Or you, well. you work for someone? Just do it for the thrill of it, mate. You know. So, um, I mean, like, why, 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 why children? I mean, I, I've asked several people, and just it's basically just children who, who've seen you. Oh, well, it's mainly when I'm out on my hunts. They're the only little, uh, the little tykes, the only ones around, really. The only ones at what I time? See. Oh, early morning, 4 a.m. 4 o'clock. You go hunting at 4 o'clock in the morning. Yeah. Well, not many people around. Just kids on scooters. So, are you responsible for, for this? Hang on. Missing cat. Lenin. Lenin? Lenin. Yeah, I think I was, mate. Yeah, yeah, I fucking had him. Right, and are you responsible for every single missing cat in the area? Well, of course I'm fucking not. That's one of the good things about cat hunting. Because sometimes... Cats do actually just go missing, and I can get that poster and track that cat down and get it. So, That's so fun. So the council pay you to get rid of these and seize them as vermin, do they? And What's the, the council? council's got nothing to do with it. Council? No council. We were wondering, we were hoping that you'd agree to this, um, whether we could uh, to go with you on a hunt in the middle of the night. You know, me and the crew. Council aren't going to be there. Well, we just want to see how, what makes you tick. We want to see, you know, your weapon of choice, your, uh, your, ha you know, how you were met. That's my weapon. Yeah. 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 It's, that's pretty hairy. It's quite, it's quite sticky as well. It's been in a cat. Uh, well, I mean, like, if, if you wouldn't mind, I mean, could we come? Oh, well, uh, don't see why you couldn't. Just maybe you, uh... That guy's a bit fat, isn't he? He'll slow us down. Yeah, Um. alright then, well, I'll tell you what, tonight, 4 o'clock, is that when you go in? Well, yeah, I suppose I could go out, yeah, tonight. Gonna get active, are you? Not me, I mean, we're here to watch you, aren't we? Yeah, you'll be active, though. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, Calvin. Uh, can I borrow your stick, mate? I've, you've seen me. You've seen my scissors. Let me. Uh... Go on. You must put them. Watch him watching you. Quite a nice stick, this. It's all right. It suits you, mate. Don't. Fire mark. Get this from where are you get it from. No, um, my grandma gave me that. Grandma. Eh? Grandma. Grand, yeah. Tell you what, right? Tomorrow. I'll keep this till tomorrow. I'll just borrow it. Bar it for tomorrow. Yeah, but what are you going to do to it? Well, nothing. But uh, if you come along, you'll get it back, won't you? Yeah. This uh, alley's a bit tight. Mr. Mr. Cat. What this? I said this, this alleyway's a bit tight. I can't. Yeah, I'm struggling. Um, yeah, do you want to carry that? Yeah, I am. Yeah, I'm sorry. Do you want to carry your stick? It's my stick. I'm sorry. Uh, sorry, I'm a bit late anyway. Um, I had to stay at my mate's house here, and uh, had a bit of bad wind because I was uh, trapping in uh, naughty trumps. Tag there, mate. Oh, so what? The fucking cat did that tag. Where, what? What am I looking at? Marcus territory. Oh, let me get that. Let me, let me try and zoom in. It says Ace Cat. 
fucking walking his territory down. How, how do you know a cat did it? It's down there, isn't it? I know, but if, if what, couldn't a cat have done one up here instead? What if it was up here? Is that the cat? I mean, it could have got a ladder. Where's he gonna get a fucking ladder from? Well, where did he get the pen? Right, he's off, he's gone off tracking. Um, basically, he's given me this. Um, and uh, he's not found one of this kind yet. But I'm presuming it's the, uh, it's the council's most wanted. Yeah. Keep up, you fucker. Oh shit, quick, you have to be fast. Oh, he's gone. Look at that, I'm gonna try and catch up. What's happened? What, mate? What's happened? I got one. Oh no, oh. Oh, God. Is it in that bag? Yeah, mate. How do you do that for, for the council? Fucking, it's got nothing to do with the council, right? Right, alright. Do it for me. Myself. I've seen some fucking things, right? Some stupid fucking things. Gangs of cats. Gangs of fucking cats. Fucking cats. Fucking scratching up drunkards' backs. Fucking disgusting. Disgraceful. It's nice that. Is that one of your is that one of your poems? Fucking is it? It is. It is. Anyways, mate. What? It's your turn. Oh uh, no, I'm not a poet, but uh, I'm more I'm quite fond of keeks. Well, uh fucking keeks it to yourself. Can't you see what I'm saying? Have your fucking stick back, mate. Yeah, yeah but, but you've modified Muffy don't you've modified my stick. I mean why shouldn't I kill a cat? Fucking hell. What would you do if you were pissed, right? And a gang of cats came up, started blading your back, tucking up on your chops, marking the territory. Yeah, well, I'll, I'll cross, just stand there, would you? I'll just well I'll just cross that bridge when I come to it, won't I? Fucking dick. What? You are Fucking doing it, You made me do it. I, I can't. I can't believe I'm doing, I did it. I'm so sort of hiding in the bush from him. Oh god. Oh. Oh. Oh, why is the council doing this? Professional.